Gyromitris corfii. Now, these are the Gyromitris gigas, but because I'm east of the Rockies, these are considered the Gyromitra corfii. And west of the Rockies, these are the Gyromitra montana. Um, of course, these are all around the world. But the corfii is the term for east of the Rockies. These are also known as beefsteaks. That's what we call them around here in Michigan. Um, there's other names, bullnose mushroom, calves brain, and believe it or not, most people when you mention false morel, this is what they're talking about. Usually when I think of a false morel, I think of a, a verpa, a verpa bohemica. But I can see, I can see how someone would get this confused with a, a yellow morel, but it's definitely not a morel with all those squigglies in the in the stem so many so many stem walls it's not one stem wall and hollow usually when I find these they're later in the season and they're cinnamon or rust colored and sometimes I could be confusing them with the other gyromitras there's other gyromitras out there and they're quite poisonous why I don't recommend you to eat the gyromitra corpii, gyromitra gigas. Many people do, which is fine, but you got to be careful. I'm going to go ahead and put these back. I won't be eating them. There's quite a big mess of them out here. I was surprised. I'm stalking new territory. I got all kinds of mushroom grounds. I won't be in the woods a lot. Thanks for watching and be careful out there with your mushrooms and keep your hands clean.
Remember, folks, if you're out, so are the ticks.